One small but nonetheless important new feature that's been added to 3D Coat 4.8.13 is the auto pick functionality that is enabled by default. What this does is allow the user to start sculpting on a multi component object like the mannequin here, whereas before you would typically have to select the layer first and then begin sculpting. If you wanted to work on another object, again, you would have to select it first. Granted, you could hit the H key as you're hovering over your object and select it. But this automatically picks it as you begin your stroke. So if I want to begin sculpting in the head region here, and then decide I want to move to the chest area, I don't have to stop. I can start right away. And you'll notice the highlight flashes once you initially click on the object. If you want to turn highlighting off, you can go to the geometry menu under highlight, either change the settings or disable it altogether. Let's go to the transform tool. And you have pick by click that you can choose. And that's a quick look at using the new auto pick functionality in 3D Coats sculpting environment. Thank you for watching. We'll see you in the next video.